Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster, and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger! Oh, last time, ooh, yes, good to see you too there, Thunder and Lightning. Uh, last time, we went through the Genodome here, and we discovered the truth about Robo's past, and the Mother Brain tried to take us down, but we didn't need Samus to take that thing down, we were just fine. Alright, so let's head to the end of time, and let's learn about our next mission. Whee! All right, let's go ahead and get off. All right, and I believe if we talk to this guy, yes, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, the restless spirit of a proud knight slain by Magus in the Middle Ages, lingering in the present, yes. All right, so that's the one that we're gonna do today. <laughs> Yeah, and that kind of gives us a little hint as to what to do there. Alright, so now let's go ahead and get our party ready to go. And for right now, I may change this up, but I'm going to get my traditional Frog, Chrono, and Magus party going for right now. And I might change it up a little bit later, but let's keep them for right now, and we'll get going. Now, to start this quest, we We're actually going to hit, uh, let's see, yeah, we're going to take off. And we're actually going to head to 600 AD, Middle Ages. Yep. The place that we want to go is actually down here, kind of this area right down here. Yeah, let's go ahead and land. And Tavern is where we want to start. Now we might have, remember us talking to this guy earlier. By the way, uh, if you talk to Toma, sure did. Uh, yeah, probably, but that's fine. Heh <laughs> Uh, guess what? I already found it. Ha 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 ha. Anyways, if we talk to this guy... Oh no! He lost his carpentry tools! Well, we're gonna have to, uh, get those back. And I'll show you where they are. Oddly enough, the carpentry tools are actually in the future. I don't quite understand how this works, but it does. Go ahead and land. And go to the chorus in here. And if you talk to this guy... So, I think you've had quite enough. Man, this guy's a drunkard. Look at that. He's not even putting down his... Ooh, dang! Wow! Yes, I want to borrow the tools. Alright, sweet! Yeah, you're busy drinking. Like, ghost, what are you talking about? No. Oh. Oh, that's not good at all. We'll have to see what we can do about that. Heh, <laughs> yeah, there's your gluttons for fun. Uh, yeah, I already got it. So, once again, I have... Uh, oh. Yeah, I do really need anything. Nope, we're good. Uh, yeah, so, we, so we've really essentially destroyed multiple generations of Toma. Um, just for fun. So if you talk to this guy... Yeah, we, wait, did she say she'd be nursing a sore jaw? Man, I love a woman that takes charge. She's gonna whoop some ass. I like that. And we get the carpenter's tools. Very nice. Okay, now I want to show you something real quick before we go ahead. Uh, let me just... Actually, uh, yeah. So actually what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna save a state real quick. Oops. Yeah, so save a state. State is saved. Let's head over to the northern ruins. They said that there was a ghost here. See that that area is blocked. However, hmm, there's a ghost. Let's go check it out. Grrr. Now it's time for a boss battle against. Whoa, Cyrus! That's the name of Frog's friend. Oh man, well, that's not good. Okay, let's. Well, okay, so physical attack. Can work. Let's try some magic. Hey. Uh oh. All right. Ooh, creepy. Okay, let's get out of here. We can't escape. Okay. Now, I believe... I think if you talk to this fight, or, um... I, I mean, you can't win this fight for sure. Supposedly, if you don't do anything, he'll just stop attacking you, and then the battle will end. But in my playthrough of this, he just kept attacking me, and I died. So I'm going to go ahead and load a state. Uh, so basically, I, they say you have to go in and just kind of see him there. Okay, so we know he's there. All right, very good. 
So that's what happens if you get into a battle with him. So don't even worry about that. There's nothing you can do about that now. However, now that we have tools, we can go here. And I'll go here, land. Hey, guess what, buddy? Man, that guy looks like he's been just sitting there drinking, too. But at least we if we give him twos, he's going to do something. No. <laughs> His face is great. Listen, man, I'm encouraging you to get drunk. You should thank me. Yeah, you can have him. That's fine. All right, very good. So now that he has a job, or now that he has his tools, he can finally get some work done. If you go here... All right, fantastic. All right, and they're going to start repairing the ruins up to the north. Sweet. And away they go. All right, so let's head up north. Let's see if we can find something here. It'd be nice to repair the ruins. That's great. What do you mean you've done all we can? Oh, I see. <laughs> what is a do not? You lazy do not, maybe do nothing? I don't know. Okay. Well, anyways, what we want to do is head up, uh, set up this uh, this way first. Yeah, there's some enemies down here, so I'll take these guys out. I got some new enemies here, ghost knights. Actually, Magus is going to be the man here. Oh! There you go. Good shot, Magus. Ooh, I like that. Yeah. Okay. Well, that didn't work so good at all. Looks like magic's going to be the way to go permanently. I'm going to have to swap out my party so I get some magic users. Uh, okay. Uh, Magus, finish him off, please. Boom! Thank you. Wait. Steals MP! No, 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 don't do that! Oh, great. Yeah, so you want to watch out. Their finishing attack actually steals some of your MP, which is no good. That's kind of annoying, actually. Okay, uh, well... Okay, I guess, Magus, you're out for now. We'll put Luca back in for now. Uh, okay, very good. Uh, let's see. Then we want to go over here. And more enemies. That's great. Okay, Luminaire. That's fine. Um, you're, there's going to be a lot of healing that we're going to have to do in this. And you could go to the end of time and, and do it, but I'm probably just going to use the end right there. Nice shot. And, of course, he steals the end. That's great. That's fine. Do it again. Zero from zero is zero. That's fine. Alright, very nice. Very good there. No problems at all. Okay, now we'll go up here. And we get a turbo ether. Very good. Okay, now you can see that there's a hole in the floor there. So there's nothing we can do about that. Now you want to be careful on your way back. We have more of these ghost knights. Alright. Deal with them. Uh, I guess let's try watering it. That's fine. Actually, I probably could use frog squash. That would have been fine. What I'm really doing is waiting for Lucas turn so that she can unleash with flare! Oh! Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Very nice. <laughs> Whoop that ass right there. Oh, now they're all gonna. Uh oh, I hope they don't kill Luca. Thought about that. Don't kill her, please. Thank you. Very nice. All right, and there you go. And that's how you deal with those guys. Very good. Okay, now if you go up here, I don't believe there's anything we can do up here. Let's take a look. Oh, that is done. Okay, great. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. So it looks like there's a little. Looks like we can. Ooh, looks like we can do some stuff up here. That's fine. We got some new enemies here: Fallen and Flesh Reapers. Uh, Luca, deal with this, please. Actually, I probably need to heal up after this, too. But uh, all right, we can deal with this. Thank you. Yeah, Luca's gonna be your woman in charge here. Very nice. Actually, you know what? Um, I just thought of something. I want people to get tech points. So, uh, you know what? I am going to swap out my party. Sorry. Uh, who needs tech points? Ayla does. Marley does. And actually, Magus does too. So, that's fine. Uh, and actually, I'm going to do a quick 
change here. Sorry, the BCS universe. All right, Luca, you did a good job with that. But that's done because Magus is gonna get that, gonna get that golden stud there. There we go. And you know what? I have enough ethers. I can just give him. I can know I have enough ethers. Yeah, I have enough ethers. It's like sixty. Perfect. Okay, very good. Now Magus can whoop some ass because he needs the tech points. Okay, so another hole in the floor there. So basically, what you have to do is go through and clear out all the enemies on a floor. Magus. Uh, fire tube should work. These being skeletons, they should be with the fire. Go. And there you are. Very nice. And every... No oh, iceberg toss, that's fine. Yeah, every little bit that you can gain from tech points wise is a good thing. So basically, all, this is it. all you need to do is just go through, clear out all the enemies that you can. The enemies will never respawn in this location. So you can use that to kind of help you out there too. And then, uh, and then I'll show you what happens after that. All right, and there you go. No problems there. And a level for Marley, very good. Okay, and let's go up here. Can we do up here? Nope. Okay, and that's all we can do here. So. Once everything has been in, uh, once there's nothing more that you can do, what you do is go down here. We actually have to head back to, uh, let's see, where's the, uh, is this the guy's house? I think it is. There we go. Right, 2,000 gold? Ugh, okay, that's fine. <laughs> I love it, you lazy do-nots. And now basically they're going to go, and they're going to... And they're going to go repair it. So what I'm going to do is rest up at the inn. Whatever that is, yeah. Go ahead and rest up and heal up at the inn. Ten gold, absolutely. And very good. I can't remember if that healed up everybody. Yep, it did. Fantastic. Good. So somehow the spirit of the inn is sending across time. Okay, very good. Okay, made one slight change to my party, and I've now put Frog in the lead. Um, and I'll show you why here in just a minute. Okay. Alright, fine. And I think also, uh, you can't, when you go back to try to talk to the guy, if the floor is not completely cleared, he won't, uh, you won't be able to do anything. So, okay, uh, now I want to go this way. If you go through here, aha, this door has been repaired. Very nice. And then we go up this way, and whoa, is that a, what is that, is that a tombstone? Just point this room here. Yeah, it looks like a tombstone, this kind of reminds me of Daryl's tomb from Final Fantasy VI. Oh, the fool, the fool who defied Magus, what? What kind of crap is that? Oh, Frog's back. Oh, what's that? Is he going to fight Magus right now? Whoa! Cyrus? Are you alive? Wait, Glenn? Oh, man. Oh, that's right. That's Frog's real name. Is Glenn. That's right. No, how, how is it that these guys get to... To, uh, to talk to spirits anyways. That's kind of cool, I guess. Now, look at that. This is great. Oh, I see. I think this is just all funny with Magus sitting right there, but... Oh, yes. These guys were, were best friends, as you can tell. Oh, that's cool. Wait, how does he... Well, I guess he was watching from above. That's awesome. Oh, you're leaving again, Cyrus? No, Frog, get it out quickly! No, oh, too slow. Oh. No problem, we can do that. Oh, poor Frog. 
almost like he loses Cyrus again. Wait, what? What? What's happening to the Masmune? Oh ho ho ho! Ho ho ho! The music is happening. Something's about to go down. What? What? Uh oh! Are we gonna lose the sword? Are we have to fight these guys? What's going on? But yet, still something epic is going on. Oh, I see. That's true. Wait, what do you mean? You've been, you guys have been holding back? What the hell? Okay, now they're a sword again. Oh, man. Oh, yes. Yes. Yes! All right! Yeah! Now what's happened is the Masmuni has gained strength. Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! That's awesome. All right. I'm just going to let this music go for a little bit because I love this music. Okay. That's nothing bad. Okay. So now check this out. So let's get over to Frog. Look at that attack power now. Look at that strength. 200 strength. That's fantastic. And now what you want to do is give him the Hero's Medal for sure. Or the Hero's Badge, rather. Because now that you've got the Masamune, this is his best weapon in the game, for sure. So definitely give him the Hero's Badge so now he'll be able to um, get doubles most of the time when he attacks. So that's awesome. All right. Very, 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 very good. Okay. Um, now what we want to do is... So I just wanted to show that scene, but we're actually going to use uh, Ayla because I want her to, um, I want her, I want her to gain some tech points. Frog's already maxed out with his tech points, so we don't need to worry about him. All right, let's go this way. And here, and I know there's some enemies that we can defeat. Are we go they through here. Oh. oh, do I need to go get those guys to repair or something again? Let's see. Hold on. I guess I've already done that. Okay, so now what I need to do, now that that scene is over, now I think we can go back and have the guy uh, repair again, I believe. Let's go, just, wait, no, I'm sorry. This area can get kind of confusing sometimes. Okay, so let's go this way. I think he can repair again now. Let's go double check. Yep, okay, so pay 2,000 gold. So yeah, so the second event of the group of three is is um, getting uh, Cyrus's ghost to come back, and I get maybe that's the oh by the way oh okay oh so now they said they're all done. There's nowhere left we can repair, so the ruins are completely completely fixed. Um, I should I should mention this right time or right now. Now that we've gone through that scene with Cyrus, this place is now called the Hero's Grave, which I think is kind of cool. All right, so let's go up this way. If you go up here, yeah, everything's all fixed. And we get an elixir. Very nice. And through here. Ah, oh, crap. All right, no problems there. Magus just whooping all kinds of ass. Okay, more enemies coming. Woo! And we got a new enemy here. Fallen and Souls. So, again, just use fire attacks with Magus. And you'll be able to destroy these guys no problem. And there you go. Oh, okay. Uh, wait. I'm sure physical attacks isn't the way to go. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, uh, they probably just have low HP. All right, go Marley. I'm guessing they just have low HP, just kind of like those shadow enemies earlier in the game. Yep, there you go. I don't know why they do that. I don't quite understand the point of that. And Ayla learns Tailspin. Sweet. Is 
that her final tech? I can't remember. I want. I can't remember if that's her final tech. No, Dino Tail uh, is her final tech. So I'll finish learning that up here. Okay. And a level for, for Magus. Very good. Now, keeping with the trend of current things, we do not want to remove the item. Same thing here. Do not remove the item. Yeah. So just like before, we want to do the same thing. Okay. I love how fast Ayla can move, by the way. She's just rolling. That's awesome. Okay. And same thing here. We do not. Do not remove the item. Because you know what's going to happen. All right, let's go ahead and get out of here. And now we can warp. To 1000 AD. And. Uh, by the way, once you go here. Yeah, so it's still called the Hero's Grave. And Cyrus is no longer there. He was blocking that entrance from before. And if you go down here, I believe the message has changed. Let's go up here and just double check the grave. Ah, see, the brave Sir Cyrus, whose spirit lives on in his true friend, Glenn. I think that's pretty cool. And we get a magic capsule for our troubles. Sweet. Very, 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 very good. Okay, so now let's go check out those chests. Or those, uh... Those items that we let grow for 400 years. Uh, the... The chests, by the way, uh, don't contain any new items. They're, they're the same regardless, so it doesn't matter if you open the chests. But the pendant items, for sure. I should have got that other one first, but oh well. Okay, now if we go here. The Omni Maru is upgraded, and we get the Suzaku. Excellent. And we get the Valkyrie Bow, which is the best weapon in the game from Marley up to this point. So let's get that equipped on Marley. If I can ever get to her. Nope. Yeah, good increase in attack power. Um, okay. And let's see. Um, that's Suzuki. I think that's a new weapon. Is that right? Um, yeah, so it's just another weapon for Chrono there. Four times damage for a critical hitch, which is nice. But if you don't get a critical hit, then it doesn't really matter. So I'd much rather take 70% critical hits than... Plus it's an increase in attack power than having to get double damage for a critical hit. And if we go here... And we get the Moonbeam Armor, another excellent piece of armor. So let's, let's try getting that equipped. And Magic Defense plus 10, which is pretty good. Uh, and, let's see, I guess the only downside about that is uh, it, you absorb, well, I guess I'll get that, that's fine. You lose uh, the ability to absorb something, but if you can defend against everything, I guess that's fine. Okay, so last thing I'm going to do now is get out of here, and I will just, you know, I'm just going to meet you back on this floor, having warped to 600 AD. And so basically, just go out in the epoch, repoch, re-get back here, and I'll just meet you back here to save time. Okay. So now I'm here, and I'm in the Middle Ages. And if you go here, these pendants are, uh, the chests are here. And now we can remove the item. And we get the Nova Armor, which is basically a not as good version. Here, I'll show you. A not as good version as the, my horse chrono, as the Moonbeam Armor. So, but it prevents all status ailments, which is nice. But if you already have the Vigilance hats, then you should be good to go on that. All right, now let's go up this way. Get those last two boxes, which are basically just, and this is really just for completion's sake. Um, and they're basically just not as good versions of the new items that we picked up, which I, which I won't be using anyways. But again, for completion's sake, we'll get it. And we get the Onimaru. And I'll show you what these things here do in a little bit. Sure, we'll pick up this. We get the Siren's Kiss, which is a weapon for Marley. 
So, let's pull up Marley. Yeah, so it may inflict stop, which is good, but it's a very low chance. And besides, she'll be she'll be using uh, magic anyways when I do use her. So, there's that. And if we go to Chrono. Yeah, see, Omni Maru, not as good. There's the Suzaku, but the Rainbow is the really the way to go. And now we're done with that side quest. But what other side quests await us? Or are there any more side quests that await us? You'll have to wait till next time to find out. So then, this is BCS Buster signing off. Don't forget to like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter, BCS Buster LP. Check out my blog. Check out my donations page. And as always, take care, y'all.